That was just to give you a sound of what I drive to. Also, today it hasn't been a particularly good day. I've got bad news on several fronts. Um, number one, uh, the carer phoned to tell me that um, Jocasta, the girl that was trying to climb with her humongous baby Oedicopus, um, Jocasta died overnight. She vomited out something like a clot either out of her lungs or out of her stomach. We're not quite sure why. So baby Oedipus was put into um, a cage with some of the other bats and was hanging. He's been fine. He um, hasn't had any issues. He doesn't really like to be fed by the carer. So she's just shown him the food and he has been eating. But he prefers to, the milk bar, mum's milk bar. And she hasn't been really well enough to um, manage him. But um, he's still had a full belly, so he's doing okay. However, she found mum dead this morning, having vomited up the um, clot. And she found Oedipus, the baby, also dead in the cage next to her, just on the bottom of the cage. So we're really not sure in any way why. We have no idea. Because he's been in with the other uh, mums with babies overnight, because his mum, Jocasta, couldn't manage him, uh, hang on. Uh, he's been in contact with mums and babies, so we need to send him off for testing just on the off chance that he might have lysivirus, which is doubtful, but we need to exclude it because he's been in contact and he's a, um, a weird, unexplained and totally unexpected death. So Carrie, our favourite pathologist, is going to do a necropsy on him just to see uh, <clears throat> if there was any trauma in him. She'll also just have a basic look at mum and see if mum died of trauma. If mum died of trauma, then maybe he was lucky, and well, not lucky enough, but maybe he also died of trauma. Anyhow, we have to kind of figure out what's going on with this puzzle. So that was sad news that I lost two of the babies from Friday. Um, Friday night school, Tarzana, well, I um, found her dead when I came back from another rescue today. Um, she was fairly bright eyed this morning, but she's dead, which is probably a blessing because I think I would have had to euthanize her. So that's a bit of a bugger as well. and. I rescued another bat this morning that had bilateral electrocuted thumbs with massive swelling up his um, uh, forearms. So he's uh, gone to God as well. And well, that makes it a four death day, doesn't it really? So I'm on my way to the zoo with a couple of bodies. Well, I think I'm going to have to ring the bell, aren't I? 